Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to Krozna Creations, another exciting tutorial. And in this tutorial, you'll be learning how to create mountain terrains in Maya. This is going to be a beginner's tutorial, so please don't hesitate. Even if you are a fresher to Maya, you can still try it and you can still achieve the same output. Uh, with that being said, let's get started with the tutorial now. I would also like to tell you that there are quite a different methods to create terrains and this is one of them I would feel that this is uh, one of the easiest ones so I'm teaching you that today first let's take a polyplane and uh, we'll go to polyplane here and adjust its width somewhere around like 50 or so and even the height like around 50 I guess yep but one important thing here is that the subdivision it has to be higher the higher the subdivisions are, the better the output is. So I would crank it up to like 100 I guess. And also this one to 100. Okay, once you are done with the subdivision height and width, let's go to sculpting now and uh, double click on the sculpt tool. The tool setting window is open now. As you can see that the size is 20 or the brush size is 20 and the strength is 200. Well, we are not really concerned about that as of now but we'll get back to this later but first let's go to the stamp here as you can see that there is already a stamp imported here and I'll show you how to do that first it will be turned off anyway so you just click on this turn it on and click on import here and it will direct you to a path directly where you have saved your image there and click on the image whichever you want and I'll put the link in the description for the image also so open the image so that is the same image which has been opened here uh, you can really flip it down like vertically horizontally it really depends on you can display with this that won't be a problem now let's just click and drag on this plane let's see what's gonna happen do you see the changes here yes that is really how you create a mountain terrain in Maya The strength of the brush directly influences the height of the terrain. And this is how you create a mountain terrain in quite easy steps. So that's it for the tutorial guys. If you have any questions, please comment down below and I'll report back as soon as possible. Thank you so much. Until next tutorial. Bye.